Thank you for joining us for Office Hours with the Headmistress. I'm Kirsten Fox from Park City School of Wine. Today we're talking about weight. We're not talking about the weight you're gonna gain when you get in all these great restaurants. What we're talking about is weight of the food that you're eating and the weight of the wine in your mouth. So what that really is tied to is the alcohol content of the wine. The higher the alcohol content, generally the heavier the wine feels in your mouth. So in talking about foods and pairing them, when you look at an Asian stir fry, you're gonna go for a light white wine because that's such a light food. So you're looking at a Riesling. As you move into a medium bodied white wine of a Sauvignon Blanc, which has a lot of wonderful character, you're going to look at maybe pairing that with a great light pasta or a chicken with maybe that's marinated, but not have a heavy sauce on it. As you move into the heavier wine, the whites, Chardonnay, heavy, heavy, and it's going to be paired with some beautiful chicken with beautiful heavy sauces and some of the heavier pastas as well. Then, moving into the red, so much fun, the Pinot Noir, light, beautiful, earthy and fruity wine, great with, say, a grilled flank steak over a bed of greens. It's not going to be overpowering either way. Medium weight, you're jumping up into a Malbec or, say, a Cabernet. Um, and those are going to be perfect with a grilled piece of meat, um, but maybe not a heavy sauce on it. And then moving into the Syrah, Shiraz, those are really up there in alcohol content. And those will be really good with those big cuts of beef with heavy, heavy sauces. Thank you for coming into Office Hours with the Headmistress. I'm Kirsten Fox. Detention, anyone?